Hi guys, welcome back to GP Reactions. I hope you're well, hope you're having a great day. And as always, thanks to everybody that subscribed. Um, so I'm now going to be reacting to a song from the Eurovision Song Contest. Um, I watched the scoring last night and I missed all the songs, so I can't really judge any other song on it. But I started, I turned over um, on television just as the scoring was started. So I recorded that because I'd had a really long week and I was trying to catch up on some other television watching. And, um, and I forgot all about that it was on. I usually watch it because it's quite entertaining. Um, but I have to be honest. Um, I do enjoy the scoring more than the songs most of the time. But um, yeah, so I started watching the, the scoring and I'd heard uh, that our entry was um, supposedly quite good um, and that he was a good singer. I saw him being interviewed um, and I think he had like a TikTok thing going on. Um, so I knew that this guy had a chance, we had a chance of not getting zero. But as the scoring kind of like went on, and eventually Ukraine won. Um, but really, I think having the United Kingdom come second, I think they probably were the true winners. Um, but the commentary was saying that uh, the um, the rest of the artists, um, there were some really, really good songs amongst them. And any one of about four could have won it. So... Um, I've never heard this song before. This is the actual performance from Eurovision. Um, if this gets blocked, it gets blocked. I'm going to have a go at reacting to it anyway. And um, uh, I don't know anything about Sam Ryder. I don't know anything about this song. I haven't even looked up who Sam Ryder is. Um, so I'm going to go into this quite cold. And this is Sam Ryder with Spaceman. So... Um, like I said, if this gets blocked, I'll, um, I'll, you know, I'll have a look at an audio version, which might be different to a live version, but, uh, here we go. Samurai Rider, Spaceman. Music and lyrics by Samurai Rider. Cool. You know I'd be floating in midair And a broken heart would just belong to someone else down there High vocal range there. I'm up in space. Up in space. The stars go on the universe. Then they'll sound like hopes. There's nothing but space. And I want to go. Search for other life, but I'd be up and thinking about the world I left behind. Cause I'm only human with the real world. I'm probably really embarrassed to say this, but I'm actually giving me the um, where that the chorus bit is um, just giving me like the chills a bit. It's yeah, this it's guy's got a really good voice as well. Um, I'm getting vibes from this, but um, yeah, I'll kind of tell you what I think at the end. Let me just take that back because I'm loving the, the chorus bit of this, but he's got such a gentle voice, but it's such a it feels like it's at such a high range.
and I wanna go. That was incredible. That was a fan. That was fantastic. I, I didn't expect to kind of get um, the the whole chills about that, but yeah, de that definitely gave me the chills. I'm. It's. I mean, uh, I'm not sure the lyrics were bad, but obviously, with like uh, thinking about Spaceman, you get kind of like Bowie vibe from that, and because he's it was a very gentle, um, slow beginning. Um, then he soared with his voice soared as as a spacecraft would. Uh, there's lots of um, uh, uh, lots of an analogies from that that you could um, draw upon, and uh, and even his even his outfit. I had, it took me a while to kind of look at it, and I suddenly thought this is not just like a random decoration. Uh, it's actually done to make it look like the straps and stuff that you might have the 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 lines on on a spacesuit. Uh, I thought that was really cool, and and yeah, so I mean, it definitely had seventies vibes to this. There was there was a Elton John esque feeling to this. I mean, obviously Elton John did Rocket Man, um, David Bowie did Life on Mars, Space Odyssey. Um, I, I, I can see that. I'm not sure whether he drew his inspiration. I think subconsciously, um, creative people draw do draw their inspirations from other stuff, and it wouldn't surprise me at all if he drew his inspirations from Bowie and Elton John because it had a combination of that. And then a guitar. Um, who, who would have? That was if he was actually playing that guitar. That was fantastic. Um, a really, really, really great song. I kind of want to listen to it again now. So. Um, yeah, well, I, you know what? We came second, so that's like winning it for the UK. Normally, if we get two points, that's you know that's a major victory. But to uh, to I think we ended up on four hundred and four hundred something points, or so there or there thereabouts. But you know we did very well anyway, and that's that's what counts. Um, <clears throat> and yeah, I think there'll be uh, a legacy. Um, I think it costs a lot of money to hold these events, so in a way, second is 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 not a bad position to have in the Eurovision Song Contest. Um, but yeah, this guy, whoever he is, Sam Ryder, he has definitely made his his mark, I think. And um, really interesting, really interesting vocals, really interesting um, performance. I actually loved the. I was listening to the. Um, to the music around it. I'm not sure if they use uh, an orchestra. Uh, I'm not sure how these things work because um, I don't often spend too much time looking into the Eurovision, but definitely uh, it felt like uh, there were proper drums, uh, whether that's just a really, really good um, synthesized drum, I don't know, but um, really enjoyable. I enjoyed that. Uh, hopefully this won't get taken down, but um, if it does, I, I'll do an audio version as well. So. Um, guys, I uh, hope you enjoyed that. If you've got any thoughts about this track, um, please join me in the comments below and let me know. And if you've ever heard of this guy before, um, I'd be curious to see if there's any projects he's working on. Um, I don't, I'm not often one to get into new music. Um, it doesn't always appeal to me, but um, if he is, it looked like he'd written it um so you know he, he's clearly got some creativity and some talent and i'd like to hear more of him i liked his voice so yeah until next time take care of yourselves and have a great day